on a goodwill message to the people of Ekukwagbo community, home and abroad. On the occasion of the 2024 New Year Festival, Iwaigi celebration, where they will celebrate on the 27th of October, 2024. My country people, on this special day, the 27th of October, 2024, the sons and daughters of Ekukwagbo, home and abroad, come together to celebrate the New Year Festival, this EYG, that is to thank God for all the harvest, all the produce, all the good life, everything, the good health, where God don't grant the people of Ekukwagbo. Now, this celebration, now a very cherished celebration, where they bring the people closer, where they bring them together, is not only about celebrating the New Year Festival, but it's about togetherness. It's about one heart, one family. It's about jollification. Oh, my country people. It's about peace and unity, love, oneness, good heart, togetherness. Congratulations to the people of Ekukwagbo home and abroad. Now, a philanthropist based in Canada, Mr. Godwin Okuose and his family don't send out congratulatory messages to the people of Ekukwagbo home and abroad and to the royal father of Ekukwagbo. In fact, make I read them according to how him put out the congratulatory message. He said, on behalf of my family, I, Godwin Okuose, Extend my warmest congratulations to our esteemed royal father and to all the proud sons and daughters of Ekukwagbo. As a proud native, I feel honored to celebrate this momentous occasion with you all. So this guy, now son of the soil, where be say, even though say him not there for Ekukwagbo, him still they resonate with Ekukwagbo people. Him still they celebrate with Ekukwagbo people because Home is home. Whether you go abroad though, you don't live for abroad for one million years though, your home is your home. So, I myself also, they joined the people of Ekukwagbo to celebrate this New Year festival and to thank God for the good life and prosperity, for keeping us safe and alive. The New Year festival is not only a time to celebrate for unity, but also a time to offer our deepest gratitude to Almighty God for the bountiful harvest we have received. It is a celebration of our rich culture and heritage, a moment to strengthen the bonds that unite us as a people with a shared vision for the future. This festival serves as a powerful reminder to each one of us, sons and daughters of Ekukwagbo, of our roots, it is a time to reflect on who we are as a community and what we can achieve collectively to contribute to the growth and development of our beloved Ekukwagbo. He went further to say, I would also like to take this opportunity to express my heartfelt gratitude to Honorable Engineer Jerry Ehiwario the executive chairman of Ika South Local Government Area of Delta State for the remarkable milestones he has achieved in this short period of his administration. His dedication and efforts are a true source of pride for our community. He also extends his heartfelt congratulations to our royal father, King Solomon Ago. Ezeri Ohaye I of Ekukwagbo Kingdom on the successful celebration of the New Year Festival October 27, 2024. Ekukwagbo is my pride and I am honored to be part of this great community. Ago, 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 Nitonefi. From the son of the soil, a philanthropist based in Canada, Godwin. Okuwose, founder Godwin Care Foundation. Thank you very much for watching GMTV. Rosalind reporting. <laughs> I'm not